Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Kim. Tonight's video is going to feature food that I bought at Aldi for $25 and under for a pre-birthday dinner. I turned 60 at the end of this month. We're having two friends over so it's going to be $25 worth of groceries that I'm uh, making a meal out of for four adults. So tonight I will shop it. I will show you what I got, how much I spent on it. Then I will cook it up. I'll show you some clips from that. Plate it up. Uh, I'm going to be baking some uh, birthday cake with uh, molds that I purchased on Amazon recently and some things for my husband. We're also going to be thrifting tonight and going on a walk. So that's what uh, this week's video is going to be all about. And until uh, after the holidays, most of my videos are going to be on Sunday, are going to be about budgeting. They're going to be seven and a half minutes long. If I have something about the holidays or shopping, uh, you know, home related, travel related, thrifting related, I'll feature those videos on Tuesday night. So for those that like videos just kind of about um, home and thrifting and shopping and shopping hauls as far as uh, non-food shopping hauls and travel and just things that, you know, gardening and things that I'm doing around the house, those videos will be on Tuesday night, 6.30 p.m. Central Time, and all of the budgeting type and grocery shopping haul type videos will still be releasing on Sunday night at 6.30 p.m. Central Time. And they should be seven and a half minutes to eight minutes long until after December uh, 2024. So I hope you're all well. Until next week, take care and I'll see you again. Okay, here is the meal as it's cooking. So we have two of the guests that are coming. Uh, so all together, four people. And then, of course, before uh, they come, I always ask, you know, what would you like? What can't you eat? You know, special diets or whatever. Um, these are two good friends of ours for over 20 years, both of them older than I. I only say that in reference because some might think, wow, that doesn't seem like a lot of food. But, you know, as you get over 60, 65 and that, you don't eat a tremendous amount of food. But you still eat food. So I've got some potatoes. I peeled up from what I bought at Aldi. I bought everything from the Brussels sprouts, potatoes, corn. Um, though the corn had a mishap once I opened it at home. So I've got my own sweet corn in place of that. Sweet potatoes, roasted Brussels sprouts, chicken thighs, stock to make gravy. And I bought some um, cream cheese to finish off the dessert and then we're going to go out for ice cream. It's also, um, this uh, birthday weekend is also my 21st year of sobriety. So I end the 21st year and go into the 22nd year day by day. So I've got potatoes. I peeled eight potatoes when I got the bag of, of uh, um, kernel corn home from Aldi. It looked like it was crispy didn't even look like kernels, so that's fine. I took out some of my sweet corn. Um, it still counted in the price, you know, because I purchased it, but um, I will be returning that to the store and showing them what was in the bag. So we've got two ears of corn, because only two people wanted corn. Um, we've got some sweet potatoes that I've mashed back there. Only two people wanted sweet potatoes. Three people wanted Brussels sprouts, which are still in the oven. That was one and a half pounds of Brussels sprouts roasted, six chicken thighs, and then I'll be making homemade gravy. Um, I made little cakes in my mold uh, just from flour, um, sugar, butter, pumpkin mix. I made those in the molds that I purchased on Amazon and I did pick up cream cheese from Aldi which is also counted in the price in order to frost them. And then we're going to have strawberry lemonade which I also got at Aldi and all total it comes in under $25 to feed the four of us for a birthday dinner and my 21st anniversary of sobriety. So, like I said, after dinner, we're going to have some coffee, and then we're going to go out for ice cream, and that will do it for my 60th birthday. So, um, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I will have another one coming next week. It will also feature Aldi, and I think that it will either feature some baking items that you can get, um, at good prices and pre-holiday items or it's going to feature some Aldi finds um, under you know 10 15 10 dollars something like that for Christmas gifts 
Okay, this is the birthday gal's plate. So I'm not having sweet corn, but I wanted everybody to see what it looked like. So I'll just give you a quick rundown of the amount of ingredients I purchased. Eight chicken thighs. I think they were six fifty-six a pack. A three-pound bag of potatoes. Sixteen ounces of sweet potatoes. Sixteen ounces of kernel corn. Uh, the smaller box of the chicken broth. One and a half pounds of Brussels sprouts. A package of the Hawaiian rolls. I think it's a 16 or 20 ounce of strawberry lemonade. I don't think there's anything else. Well, it'll be in the description. So, you know, good enough ingredients. Eight uh, chicken thighs is great for four people. Um, you know, three pounds of potatoes. Uh, I, I'm just short of two potatoes are left over. Um, the 16 ounces of the sweet potatoes, and then only two people wanted the kernel or the corn in the cob a pound of sweet potatoes, a pound and a half of Brussels sprouts. You know, I, we always serve uh, pickles and then pickled beets, cottage cheese, and I do have a bowl of homemade applesauce made from two pounds of um, Cortland apples. So we always have that with meals if I don't mention that. But that's already in our refrigerator, and I think that we have that every single day of the month for a dinner meal is, you know, the little sides that you have. Um, so, yeah, and if I mention cottage cheese, we always have cottage cheese and pickled something or other on the table. So there we have it. That's what it looks like plated up. Now everybody else is going to get their plate, and we're going to go eat. Okay, I picked up these beautiful, these are um, Krebs um, Christmas bulbs. Okay. Oh, I think they're shatterproof, I think they're called. Uh, they were sold at Walmart and Pomida years and years ago, and I think they're still sold there maybe to this day. Um, these are like a fuchsia hot pink. Um, I got each six pack for 99 cents, no cracks, no problems. Got these little budget planners. I thought these were kind of neat. Now you can just start it all monthly, miscellaneous and savings. So if I wanted to keep it in paper form, which I used to before spreadsheets. Anyways, I wouldn't mind having a paper copy of it on hand in my purse on that. Sometimes it's kind of a pain just to... to um, loaded on my phone. Of course, I'm not going to take my laptop along, so yeah. And those were a um, dollar a piece. So I got two of them, one for this year through next year, and then for the following year. If it works out good, I'd like to have at least two years of it just to see. And then a book, um, Anthony Bourdain, A Cook's Tour. So, and that was 99 cents today. So that's what I got at um, Goodwill thrifting.